No, sir. They are the problem in the virtual environment. We have to overcome one by one, and we have Haan. to try to find the solution. Shalom, yeah. lady. Ah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you if you all can see me or listen to me, kindly wave hand or put some symbol or smiley so that I know I I can see two people. I see what you are, Anupama Sharma. Yes, you can switch on your video, and now I will hand over to you. I know. At least I know there are some people. Otherwise, I'll be talking to the wall. Uh, uh, good, good. As it is, there is nothing much to say. No, no uh, Latin being talked. It's all. Uh, Uh, very well known things most of it is already available on the internet also acha few things before we we uh, start ek to yaar in case light goes don't don't curse me it will come back so when it comes back it there may be a interruption and if at all it goes fortunately we live in yogi adityanath's area so there is no power cut as of now especially in noida i am talking from speaking from greater noida so there is no power cut so things will remain okay second suggestion i have you all try to get in touch with each other make a whatsapp group and ensure that you don't put any of the faculty members in that because they'll be very non productive and snooping on you so only keep the students I I I am telling you based on my own experience when I did the courses. Uh, reason is, you are able to share a lot of things. Otherwise, if, in isolation, you may be groping in the dark. Ideal is to get in touch with each other and uh, make a WhatsApp group and share the things. Suppose somebody is not attending a class or somebody who has got a previous knowledge and things like. and then you'll be able to be in a, a better position uh, subsequently and the last point of mine is that i'll be putting a i i might present i would recommend one gentleman to kindly consolidate all the emails and send to me uh, because uh, i will put the both the all the presentations and the at the same time uh, i there are some things which can't be explained or there is a paucity of time so i can put a link so that you can go to that link and uh, read everything whatever you desire to so it becomes the life becomes a little easier uh, somebody to say yes or uh, he's hearing if it all is hearing hello can somebody yes, okay we are able to see and hear you okay perfect 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 so that was to start with now let me come to a presentation per se how many people have bored you from since morning today ha bhai no one sir eh oh so so you are a very sweet woman no one has bored you till now can you hear see the screen yes sir yes can, can you see, see a, can you see a slide no 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 sir no, no sir, no, sir. You, you can't see the slide uh, what are you seeing your the participants face so oh. you can communicate whatever you see sir you share the share the screen okay oh, yaar ruko yaar ye jo hai na this is all bloody niche aapka likha hoga share screen okay yahan pe kahan hai aap karke apna powerpoint yeah, scene 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 share screen yeah green, green color mein hoga sir हाँ हाँ देख लिया देख लिया शेयर स्क्रीन अब इसमें प्रेजेंटेशन कहा गया ये शेयर स्क्रीन में सबसे नीचे आपका प्रेजेंटेशन आता होगा या डेस्कटॉप देखिए नहीं 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 हाँ हाँ आया हाँ स्टार्टेड नाउ सर स्क्रीन शेयरिंग मैसेजेस कमिंग ओके 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 Can you now see? It's still no, sir. buffering, sir. Okay. Akhil Dakshit has started screen sharing his messages. No, screen sharing is paused. No, yar, ye kya hai? How is it paused? I'll just call my daughter. Resume share. Okay. Can you hear? It's now. See? Sir, screen sharing is coming blank, uh, so you can see 
in your desktop you share ne just a second ye upar se drop down screen jaisa aata hai fir chala jata hai security path so fir share share new share i don't know what to do इतने लोगों को बैठा के और फिर हम कुछ कर भी नहीं पा रहे जस्ट से हो जाएगा सर अब यू जस्ट गो टू चैट शेयर स्क्रीन ओके हैव यू ओपन द पावर पॉइंट प्रेजेंटेशन यस सो प्रेस शेयर स्क्रीन एंड देन दैट पीपीटी विल कम यू कैन प्रेस दैट can you see no yes sir yes it is it has come we are able to see sir thank god thank god good returns up to a problem well uh, ladies and gentlemen uh, in, i would recommend few of you keep your mics open so that one knows there is somebody who is hearing otherwise it will be something like uh, 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 like me whenever my wife speaks it is like i don't hear anything and so <laughs> <laughs> same way thankfully she is not in the room so she can't hear what i am saying so at least in between keep saying something otherwise i get a feeling that uh, some no one is listening to me and i am talking to a wall okay then uh, varma thank you god bless you thank you uh, ladies and gentlemen this is a go ahead and around 5:30 5:25 okay. perfect okay if If we if we if we abandon post before five thirty, just too bad for you. No, no problem, sir. Any time in between when you get interrupted because of any reason, I will be there. Okay, okay. Take it further. Okay, take it further. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, what you see on the screen is a very basic screen, a, a basic concept on which experiential learning is. so if you uh, if you make if you see a model on the right side of it i'm sure good number of you must have already seen it earlier or must have already uh, studied somewhere or any management course or anything like that or uh, some uh, some people who know the psychology they'll also be aware of it this is the basic model on that the entire experiential training learning process is, uh, is conducted now uh, experience and learning basically as it is written on the slide integrates cognitive and behavioral learning theories as an applied approach to learning basically what is cognitive cognitive is whatever framework we all make mentally of uh, anything suppose what i am speaking right now somebody you people must have made a mental um, uh, framework that this is what he is talking this is what he means and behavior basically is the whatever environment one has been in we all have lived in different environment and you learn you have a certain a certain culture inculcates into you is by by the environment provided to you and that dictates your behavior also so you adapt your cognitive uh, thinking into the behavior what environment you live in and then you make process and that that is the way of experiential learning and that is what you experience and theoretical aspects which you have made into in your mind and then you apply it to your experience when you apply it it it, it gives you a, uh, a, a, a what do you call assessment and that is reflect a, a critical reflection of the that aspect it, i'll give you a very simple example uh you have learned something about electricity you know what electricity is and somebody till the time he doesn't get electrocuted by putting his finger or getting some he doesn't that is a experience he has got thereafter he, that is thereafter he analyzes whether it it gets to shock lagta hai ek minute yaar varma saab is again talking to me ha bhai varma कहा से करना होता है एंटर यार अलाउ वेर इज अलाउ
फलाऊ कहां से होता है भाई फाइव एंटर्ड वेटिंग व्यू फाइव को आप एंटर करा दो अलाउ 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 सर अलाउ ऑल कर दीजिए एडमिट ऑल एडमिट ऑल हां और बाद में भी कोई आता है तो उसको अलाउ करना पड़ेगा अच्छा 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 and at 5:30 you transfer the host to me so that i can uh-huh. conclude for recording in another okay perfect ye ho gaya hello ho gaya ho gaya sir 16 participants ho gaya main do will it come again on this screen on its own ha huh, it will come i mean when you press participant it will come so i don't press and i will continue like that participants okay in between you can keep pressing and see अच्छा तो बड़ा यार मेहनत का काम है ये तो <laughs> एक दो एक दो जगह है वो आप क्लियर हो जाएंगे सर हाँ चलो ठीक है ओके ओके सॉरी फॉर इंटरप्शन लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन इनफैक्ट वर्मा इज वेरी फॉन्ड ऑफ मी ही हैज टू डिस्टर्ब मी टाइम एंड अगेन ओके अब स्लाइड नहीं चल रही है वर्मा स्लाइड इज नॉट मूविंग अहेड स्लाइड चले गई सर और राइट बटन आप दबाएं उसे यूज करके थोड़ा स्लो हो जाता है हां भाई हमें लग रहा है स्लो हो जाता है हां स्लो हो जाता है तो आपको थोड़ा वेट करना पड़ेगा ओके ओके चलो बटन दबा के नेक्स्ट करने से आएगा सर हां नाउ व्हाट इज एक्सपीरियंस लर्निंग अह हाउ हाउ डू वी लर्न बेसिकली देयर आर टू basic assumptions sorry i uh, uh, i will keep flowing like that and um, in any case i'll send the presentation subsequently uh, two basic assumption first is people learn by experience immediate and here now experience as well as from the concepts and books uh, which they have uh, they have uh, studied their learning uh, is a conical uh, what do you call method in which you start from the basic first you go from the uh, uh, lectures then you come to the practicals and people learn differently that is styles now what are these styles you see some people like to learn by uh, hearing like what we are doing right now i am talking and you are hearing but please realize this is the most primitive way of like and and the basic way of learning whereas lectures are uh, if you see the retention power it is hardly 5% which you get when you do it yourself post this lecture when you go and take out your books or uh, uh, read them or you see a audio visual in terms of a presentation which is being shown or subsequently you go to the internet and read something then the percentage in terms of your retention goes up and if you try, uh, try to do things on your own yourself that really it uh, uh, after that a lecture demonstration i'm sure you all must have uh, did, uh, done it some of you must be science students first is the lecture thereafter you go to the practical lab you do a th- experiment first it is demonstrated uh, by the by the uh, professor in your class and subsequently you do it yourself now i when i you see i joined as a raw student when i joined the army and uh, thereafter it, um, i have been an instructor in the in the indian military academy also i can tell you when the student comes when a new boy comes after selection from the service selection board he is absolutely slouchy lousy pant dhili hai pant lace joote ka khola hua hai bearing is like a like a comma can't even stand straight but the same gentleman when he leaves the indian military academy he is ramrod in terms of standing straight proper attire his turn out will be proper his dressing sense will change his haircut will change overall social conduct will also change that is what is the gradual process of learning which takes place now how it takes place initially we gave lectures 
Subsequently, he is given presses which he goes through, and thereafter there are there are visuals which are shown in the halls of various battles and various uh, drills and things like, and also a demonstration. We literally simulate a battlefield in a small area where they are the students are made to sit and watch it. and also see what who all have failed who have succeeded and what why the reason for the failure reason for success and then they evaluate all this while he is making his cognitive learning is taking place he is actually uh, uh, structuring something based on his experience and thereafter he is made to do himself we call them uh, exercises these exercises also first initially they are done on a sand model i'm sure you all know janmashtami mein jo sajate hai na janmash models banate hain that is called a sand model some of you must have seen in the english movies they show battle wali jo war movies hoti hain usme they show on a table the tanks being moved and things like basically it's a sand model where they conduct a mock battle and thereafter we take them on ground and make them go through an exercise case in point what i want to explain is no one can be put into the battle field without going through all these processes otherwise he'll cut a sorry figure he may die prematurely without if he does not have the skills which we uh, he needs to develop before he's put in the battle field so this is what is the process of learning and this is the learning pyramid we all follow in uh, life possibly we don't realize it is uh, in subconscious possibly uh, 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 we are gradually learning and the, these things are uh, most of it is by experience now as you keep experiencing this pyramid may you keep coming down and you reach practice by doing things yourself when you go through an exercise to top it all thereafter you land up in the actual practical utilization of the training all this while case in point i can tell you i had uh, done lot of firing all kinds of things but first time i had a encounter in the valley that was my first experience of uh, having an encounter with terrorists and all this training what you have been imparted that gets executed by your reflexes to the situation specific situation being created another example of this is uh, you all must have heard about abhinandan who had sorry ladies and gentlemen i will always give examples of the army air force and all because all my life i have been in the same organization my examples perpetually may be from that abhinandan the gentleman who uh, shot down a f16 aircraft he wouldn't have been put overnight into a pilot seat and he wouldn't have got the skills to in uh, to go for a a pursuit and uh, 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 destroy a more superior air the skills have been refined over a period of time by virtue of training to a level that his reflexes knew if this situation comes i have to do this if this situation comes i have to do this and he he had better skills than the pilot of pakistan and that is why he was able to knock down uh, f16 that besides that his aircraft was lesser speed lesser maneuverability so he got hit by somebody else and he landed in pakistan and got him back it is just an example i thought i a very apt example to be given now what is cognitive learning theory i'm sorry if somebody can read it out and say something whoever uh, is li- i like two way communication more than a monologue so can somebody read this slide and uh, say something and try to explain it anyone about cognitive learning method hello yes sir yeah hello yeah yes yeah. said uh, cognitive learning involves the acquisition of problem solving by organizing information and creating frameworks or models for understanding relationship between ideas to enhance meaning what do you mean by that it's more about uh, perception actually the same thing what we were talking about basically you make a framework mentally you you yes. when, uh, it is whatever you brain may you decide that this is what it it, uh, it it means this is what i have to do to do it practically on ground 
so that is about it wherever the brain is involved you can call it a cognitive learning the same the image shows it very clearly you get a stimulus you make make and you respond ye tum log ka yaar ye isko minimize kar deta hu main ha you respond to so, this jo aapka jo dimag hota hai whatever processing it does that is what is the cognitive uh, uh, processing you may uh, that formulation of the framework is the cognitive part of it which is based on the your uh, on various issues that also includes the uh, what do you call your your behavioral pattern that is the environment in which you have lived okay connected to this is sorry i'll rush because there is a time uh, uh, given to me i'll try and uh, now somebody else uh, can can explain this also it is quite uh, basic Uh, behavioral learning theory otherwise it will be a monologue anupama since i saw her name earlier until she is left uh, sir jitendra here ha ah, jitendra chalo yeah behavioral learning theory behavioral learning includes learning that changes an individual's behavior and may encompass any of number of conditioning experiences that create a behavior change or respond to a stimulus like whenever we conduct a individual training program on basis of the, this behavior like he is lacking somewhere at some of the part so it the basics of individual training that kind of behavior learning exactly same what i told you what is uh, uh, what i may does to a army officer yes sir it is basically you make a permanent change into his in fact if you read the right side portion it may give you a better perspective behavior learning according to behaviorist learning can be defined as the relatively permanent change in behavior brought about as a result of experience or practice basically what it implies is it made changes your entire behavior and social conduct permanently or it improves your skills and so at uh, hones your skills uh, to better more more refined terms permanently the behavior behaviorist recognize that learning is an internal event however it is not recognized as a learning until it is displayed by overt behavior have you understood basically any learning is meaningless till the time it doesn't improve the skills of the individual who is being imparted a training again a, a boy goes to nda comes to ima and passes out um, uh, please give me any other example for any other uh, organization i'm sorry uh, my entire career has been uh, nearly 40 years in the army so i know that part but any one of you can give a example of uh, uh, even mba does it you what your mba a normal graduate goes and does an mba and basically mba is no education if you ask me mba mba is only improving skills in certain certain way of conducting which is supposed to be required which is required for leadership in the corporate world and that is what mba is all about when it terms of formalize uh, degree and things like that is not the aim of it and possibly it brings in the permanent change in the individual who does a mba now quality of training depends on the institute in which you go that is why iits and iims are considered to be more uh, more um, uh, higher caliber mba being pro being made, uh, brought out of out of them than the other institutes and some of them are extremely poor quality who are overnight operators i'm sure you all must have seen while driving from delhi to dehradun there are so many of them in 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 between so so can anyone give a example of an mba institute hello it's similar as i am anyway i do i ha bolo 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 not 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 equal plan to ima sir i mean as a ten mark or a benchmark ima ota it's a benchmark you can compare to any mba institute to army degree college or rv schools now but don't you think mba institute does make a bring in a change lot of uh, change in the people 
sir, does it improve does it improve people in terms of the skills sir two different different uh, verticals are you are talking about like uh, in the army segments the first thing we have learned that is discipline in uh, the mba segment we learned about the market trend ah uh, <laughs> nahi the skill i agree with you the skill may be different because the the requirements are different yes sir yes. requirements are different so uh, in both mainly we in both uh, segment we uh, learn uh, management skill actually you learn management skill and those skills correlated to the top of, type of job in which you are going to be put definitely yes yes yes, 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 uh, yes, so yes. Are, i'm just giving you example and uh, similarly you can get mba is a uh, also improves the skills also i have seen very raw people get very refined and become very high caliber uh, in in terms of uh, public speaking in terms of debates in terms of uh, uh, it skills in handling computers uh, yeah. they they making powerpoint presentations be fooling uh, uh, i think in corporate also yeah. similar conditioning or uh, behavioral change happens yeah so say for, for example if a sales person joins in a sales profession yeah after certain degree of training and certain point of engagement yeah his behavior gradually molds towards a sales person's behavior yes. Uh, yes i have also seen collection executives or people who are in the business of collection have a different mindset and a behavior than a sales person exactly that is what is cognitive and the environment in which they are they, it is the combination of the two where they, and that improves their skills in that particular field yeah but there is a behavior difference distinctly seen in a ops person and a sales person and a collection uh, professional so absolutely you know, right and they all detest the hr chap that's what <laughs> i feel most depends as long as the appraisals are done with right percentages <laughs> chalo okay now basic model remains the same ladies and gentlemen it is nothing special no latin and this involved uh, the core of the model is a simple description or learning cycle it's a cycle i'm sure all of you know we'll just uh, the first uh, uh, slide which i had shown how the experience is translated into concepts which in turn are used as guidance this is now i'll come to this a little later next slide me people are people are thought to learn through experience and the process is conceived into four stages now these are the stages we'll come to the uh, so unfortunately i cannot show multiple slides together okay i'll i'll go to this part. this is the slide i was talking of these are the stage it's a constant cycle you experience you reflect on it then you conceptualize ki what corrections i need to do and then you again uh, active experimentation you do then again you experience and this is the way your your skills keep honing what the gentleman before me was saying is exactly same the recovery chaps de develop a certain skills and uh, behavioral uh, pattern which is based on the experience and they know whom to deal with in what methodology to so, uh, like uh, finance people they when they are dealing with the market then every day up and down they exactly know when to react how to react with what to sell what to buy at a fixed time and over a period of time by virtue of experience by uh, an analysis they have reached that uh, skill which they they can, that's why most of us at least people like me prefer giving money in the mutual fund than experimenting and burning fingers by buying shares and selling shares myself if somebody can give a better example i'm most welcome gentlemen please be participative i feel very happy if somebody gives a example or talk so we know what is happening at least i would also learn a lot i am at civil seat uh, civil setup uh, a little late in life yes anyone it, this with this model this this slide is quite self explanatory i thought okay now i have become a little skilled in admitting people i have admitted somebody okay can anyone uh, elaborate now i'll go back to this this slide a little one slide back yeah. 
तो आगे ही जाती है पीछे जाती ही नहीं यार इट डजेंट गो सर प्रेस द लेफ्ट सर राइट क्लिक से प्रीवियस लेफ्ट हां प्रेस द लेफ्ट एरो ऑन योर कीबोर्ड सर हां ना वो तो इतना तो कर लेता हूं यार मैं हाँ कुछ आगे च, आगे चली गई पीछे नहीं गई तो पीछे ले... प्रेस हो जाएगा हम हाँ, अभी आ इफ यू कोरिलेट विद दैट मॉडल इमीडिएट एंड कंक्रीट एक्सपीरियंस इज द टॉप वन व्हिच इज द बेसिस फॉर ऑब्जर्वेशन विच यू मेक यू रिफ्लेक्ट ऑन इट एंड दीज ऑब्जर्वेशन एंड रिफ्लेक्शन आर एसिमुलेटेड डिस्टिल्ड इन टू थियरी और अ कॉन्सेप्ट दैट इज दॉटम पार्ट and then information for which is in which new uh, implications for action can be drawn that implications can be tested and serve as guides for creating a new experience now please assimilate this and then we go to that slide again okay now you see you concrete experience you make in the first thing then you reflect and make your own observations or analysis act with the, uh, the concept basically conceptualize ki what all effect will it have and then you apply it again later gentlemen the same slide is a, there is another relationship which is direct also that is concrete experience to abstract conceptualization and reflective observation and active experimentation basically there are two types of people some straight away jump into the fray and then learn and some are they reflect they watch others ki what is that fellow's experience then only learn so some people are play sub slave uh, you can say they are uh, uh, people who want to watch and learn first they watch others and then learn and some people are by active experience they jump and do it themselves and learn case in point of learning of driving i learned uh, 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 car driving in the fourth standard i was very very young i have never been to a driving school reason was my father had a car and oh, i used to in childhood when everyone was sleeping in the afternoon hum ja ke thoda chori se usme i used to fiddle because i used to watch my father driving or, or a driver we had we used to drive so you watch how he's doing it how do uh, he is clutched kar raha hai kya kar raha and this these i'm sorry la ladies don't feel offended but these type of inquisitiveness are little more pronounced in men boys than the girls girls but, uh, maybe the maybe with the uh, environment the behavioral what environment provided to both of us were used to be very different now it is on common platform so now things are very different but those days a uh, risk taking factor men always had more it's only because it was considered uh, the boys used to get more opportunities to do that not any more before any lady boxes me through this screen i'll say uh, myself not any more all are at par now uh, but sir earlier it was the practice actually ki first you observe then practice and then learn ha ah. Now what I'm, I was giving an example. There are still people do who indulge in adventurism without practice. Case in point, I have taken the car out of my officer's colony. My my father was living. Yeah. And and it was it was was my 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 so it all depends that is active experimentation where no nice. you see but before that please realize i'm just, i was just giving example please realize ki before that reflective observation i had already done maybe prematurely yeah by watching the driver but watching the uh, watching the uh, my father driving and things like Yeah. and act i started from the column active experimentation directly and uh, to concrete experience whereas majority of the people start by reflective observation majority right. and you see yeah. there are, there are some people who are doers some people are watchers so that is what i was trying to clarify yeah. okay 
Now, these are the things which you must remember because uh, you will find that you may be asked in the in the exam in case uh, whenever it is held. Uh, let me, uh, whenever it is held, you may be asked. So, that it is better that uh, uh, assimilate this important factor. Other theories also, when we come to that, I wouldn't be able to uh, talk of them, but I'll give a link with the with the presentation, you will go to the link and then read because the th all these theories, various theories na, uh, um, uh, needs to be known to you because you will be asked, may be asked in the exam. Okay. Another uh, ex uh, same thing explained in a different right. elaboration. Somebody kindly go through the slide and then we'll talk of it and somebody can talk of it. Somebody can explain it. Some lady, please do. Ladies are very, um, um, very shy, I would say. Or last time when I took class, there were a lot of children speaking. This time, I find they're very army-like, very, very abnormal. <laughs> Hello, madam. Are there some ladies also in the class? Is it? Yeah, sir. Huh? Eh? Why bolo inko? <laughs> Hello. Chalo acha tum log bolo bhai kuch. Sapne mic band kar rakhe hain apne. Hello. Bhai again I am walking to, uh, talking to the wall. Uh, Sandeep ji I think saying ah, something. Ha ah, bolo bhai Sandeep. Who's talking? Hello. Yeah. Rupesh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ah, bolo bhai. Please explain this slide. It's very basic. Very samne dikh rahi hai, yaar. Simple hai. Yeah, just... I mean, previous slide, uh, slide it was that there. Ah, yeah, it is the same, same thing. Same, so, same thing. This ah. is the experience learning integrates cognition, perception, behavior. It is... It is the same. Oh, okay. Chalo, I... I will tell you that... An effective learning must be to evolve themselves. Sir, Jitendriya. Yeah. An effective learner must be able to involve themselves in learning. Yeah. An effective learner must be able to involve themselves fully, openly, and without bias in the new experience. Reflect on the observed. Now, what is new experience? New experience. Uh, like, uh, sir. Hey, yaar, abhi to baat kar rahe Yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Concrete experience. C means concrete experience. Right, sir. Reflective observation mm -hmm. is RO. I'll go back. Okay. Key words you should remember. Yes, sir. Concrete experience, reflective observation, abstract conceptualization, and active, active experimentation. experimentation. These are the basic. This model you should char paaj bar ek plain kagas pe likho. You will. Remember it. And you can write anything thereafter because everything will revolve. Experiential learning, experiential learning will revolve around these four uh, parameters, around this cycle only. Okay. Now, this now uh, uh, reflect on observe these experiences from how many? Reflective. Right, sir. Reflect on the op. And, the, and observe these experiences from many perspectives. Okay. Now, what are these? Create concepts that integrate their observations into logical sound theories. That is abstract conceptualization, AC. Use these theories to make decisions and solve problems. That is active experimentation. Basically, experimentation. Uh, Active experimentation. Okay. Yeah, they could. Now I feel so happy at least. Kuch aap awaz to aai yaar. Koi kuch nahi to bache nahi bola. Kam nam bola to. Varna to it is pin drop silence. I am. Am I so intimidating that no one speaks? I thought I am reasonably responsive. Ha bhai. Effective learning must be able to. Chalo aur aur somebody. Abhi mat soch raha hu. Sir. Ah. Uh, Meena, they said, let me read, sir. 
Thank you, Meena. You are the you are what do you call jump in the this thing. You are on the active experimentation category. At least you have taken initiative. Others were only watching. <laughs> Chalo. Ah, bolo. So, an effective learner must be able to rely flexibly on these four learning mod modes in whatever ah. combination the situation requires. Ah. Having developed skills in each area, he or she can call on them when they are needed. What do you understand by this? So you just share the, the four learning models. Ah. So, so these skills area we develop. So ye, ye situations so always requires I think, because we learn from our experience and whatever the experience we have in future we the basically this this whole cycle keeps improving your skills. Correct. In, in each area, have you it is a goal 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 and your constant learning. Constant learning is going on. And then right, the, from the childhood it works, sir. Uh, and the quality of skills keep improving constantly. I am just connecting with the childhood. Why? Because uh, uh, I have an experience of my child only. Hmm. When my yeah. younger daughter was so small, so, uh, one day she sits in the corner of the bed. Uh, and she fell down. And after that, she never sits. Ah, uh, You are right. I will tell you, my daughter, she had... Her finger came in the door. We closed the door. Her finger came. It got crushed and it became blue. And then thereafter, she learned that. We developed a skill. Choti jab thi ki piche ki seat pe baithi thi car mein center of the seat. And thereafter, jab tak darwaza nahi band kar kehte kaan pakdo to wo aise kaan pakad ke baithi rehti thi. Jab darwaza band hote the tab kaan chhodti thi. So that had become her practice. The moment she'll keep sit in the car, she'll So that So Other thing which we had taught her that uh, any vehicle light she'll see though she has to be on the side, dangerous. So she had developed that the car is danger. Every time there is a vehicle, there is a danger. So, chalo. Okay. Flexible. Sir, question I have on this. Ah, 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 please, please. Sir, my question is that yes, some, some, so we have some experience and accordingly we act. Okay. In the future. But sometimes our uh, seniors taught us something, some values and some disciplines or some guidelines they set for us. That is and also the part of this. No, scientist. that is the I, that is the part of cognitive cognitive this thing. You have made a framework based on the inputs which you have got, and there is an environment created for where you are supposed to conduct yourself in this manner. So you can call it part of the behavior learning. And, and also cognitive learning because lot, many people defy that. Many are, things are told to them. Anything which you learn in terms of reading or watching and you frame it mentally is cognitive learning. Correct. Thick, thick, sir. Okay, sir. Okay. Thank you. Okay. There are nine keys to exper experiential learning. And now this is nothing Latin in this. These are the keys which everyone must know in case you, I'm sure all of the keys cannot be known to everyone or you cannot have all nine skills. In, uh, it is difficult to achieve them easily. But nevertheless, there are nine of you, I would like all uh, nine of you individually to please explain one of them each. It will be so nice. At least I'll know that at least nine people are attending my monologue. Hamai. Meena, you yes, elbow sir. you elbow Anupama to do do that. Sir Anupama has written the, some mic issue is there. Acha okay okay chalo some somebody else okay somebody else chalo you you only start Meena. Okay sir. first one first one try to uh, read it and then try to analyze what it is and let's have a little debate. Okay. Okay, fine, sir. Uh, so balance content and process. 
experiences should be integrated in learning concepts and theories bahut simple hai batao explain karo koi aur experiences should be integrated with the learning concepts and theories ha bhai anyone else बिल्कुल पिन ड्रॉप साइलेंस हो गई यार ऐसा तो मत करो इतनी बुरा हाल तो लेट मी ट्राई सर इफ यू अलाउ या या दिव्या दिस साइड हाय दिव्या अ सो सो एज एज पर माय अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑन एंड आई आई बिलीव दैट यू नो द फर्स्ट पॉइंट टू द एसेंशियल लर्निंग व्हिच सेज बैलेंस कंटेंट एंड द प्रोसेस व्हिच यू नो इंप्लाइज दैट यू नो व्हाइल वी हैव आवर ओन कंटेंट प्रिपेयर्ड टू डिलीवर इन द training session but it also needs to be infused with the uh, experiences stories and you know examples which the audience is able to relate with uh-huh. also you know if it is an interactive session we can pick those uh, you know experiences from the crowd from the audience and you know integrate with our notes or the preparations or the handouts we have so that he can as yes, whoever is listening to can correlate with something absolutely otherwise it will it uh, otherwise you see adult learning mein ye bada acha hai ki every adult analyzes yaar it is relevant or not relevant the moment he find it irrelevant he switches off yeah i mean this is the auto button that switches off and ah, yeah, he, he, there is no effort there is no effort it automatically switches off mole it is not relevant to me and yeah. so it is always good to correlate with the uh, so situation because everyone like right now you have 16 of you you all belong to certain fields and you correlate with your own uh, department or your own experiences and, and then apply it and so if the example is giving it becomes much easier for you to correlate and then it, it arouses a interest to learn that or reject that case in point i can give you when i did a course called bsw there was a particular weapon system which was which is called recoilless gun which which uh, hindi picturon mein to aise dikhate hain ki bada maar diya top wo actually it's a obsolete piece of equipment which has been done away with 20 years back now when i was doing the course i that is the only course i did badly reason was when i was studying in that because it was a compulsion to go through i realized this is obsolete piece of equipment it is going out of service so why should i be learning this is it is waste of time so i really did not pay any attention to that course uh, uh, two months course and came back i enjoyed myself patronized good whiskey and had butter chicken in every restaurant and came back so you see the moment i found that entire imparting of training irrelevant i mentally had switched off just a example may not be a right example for the good dis- people like you okay somebody else good divya you you were divya i so i am i right hello yes sir absolutely uh, oh, okay okay Thank perfect uh, somebody to kindly uh, follow through and come to second point and explain यार बड़ी ढीली फौज है तुम तो हमसे भी गए भीतर हो यार <laughs> हम बोलेंगे नहीं सेकंड सेकंड वाज हां या 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 सेकंड 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 टू क्रिएट अ सेफ स्पेस रूपेश ओके रूपेश चल स्टूडेंट शुड बी गिवन द अपॉर्चुनिटी टू रिफ्लेक्ट एंड पॉन्डर इन सेफ्टी आई मीन Create students should be given the opportunity to reflect and ponder in safe safety. Now, what exactly yeah. does it imply? Ah, uh, explain, Karu. Uh, what I understand, sir, um, I mean in that kind of uh, learning, mm. uh, I mean the response from a student, ah, uh. uh, maybe I mean. Um, any anyone would like to help rupesh good good you have the right lines so whatever we are talking to our students or either uh, either participants uh. we have given the ch- given them chance to prove or uh, to prove they that they have learned something or either they are doing something on the same way what we have taught reflect on them i'll yes, give sir. you a very simple example what i am doing right now i am making you read 
I am making you analyze and reflect on it and analyze and then so that you you it it, it sinks in mentally. It is a, a part of an effort. Second, yes, even opportunity to respond. Ah, to ponder over it. Yes, Hello. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ah, yes, sir. Ah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. basically ponder over it and and subsequently also when you uh, uh, in your own spare time also go through it when you receive the presentation i would like to both all of you to get the whatever i am telling you to get at the earliest if i get all the emails earlier the better so that i'll be i'll send them whatever it is worth if you go through it you can reflect that is also part of the reflection perfect very nice anyone else on the third point please So good evening, Kalpana Sharma. This side. Ha, ah, Kalpana, what a delight! Now I can see. That, <laughs> ah, the watchers are coming out to doers. Okay. Uh, uh, make it meaningful. The activity for learning must be substantive, uh, substantive and meaningful to the participants. Okay. What I understand with this is like um, this is more of like uh, uh, though you go through the whole process, but unless you find it any meaning in 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 doing something. one would not like to get associated with that so ah. there always be a learning with whatever that you do ah. so um, whatever that you are planning or it should be basically it should be uh, of some utility some relevance utility yes yeah relevance I, if uh, if relevance is not then people will not uh, certainly will not adapt to it so that is what i understood bachcho mein ye nahi hota hai ye adult education mein required hota hai bachcho mein kya hai basically you, you because you are still con- imparting basics into them so they it may not be important but when it be adults and when then by then they need to be they become more of thinkers in terms of analysis whether it is of any utility to me or not okay now we come to the next three of them ah abhi kon hai abhi to thode thode naam yaad aa hone lage hain hame अब हम भाई वो गिने चुने wahi naam bol rahe hain ab main soch raha hu varma se agle class se pehle saaron ki list le lunga <laughs> list is there sir in Achha. participant list ha <laughs> chalo chalo bolo bolo bhai fourth point somebody to cover it and explain it let's have a participative class yaar apne kya hai ye boring type bana raha waise hi tara corona ne sab kuch boring kar diya bahar hi nahi ja sakte ghar mein baith ke bolo keep a big picture perspective ha ah. experiential learning should be kept in perspective with what is actually going on in the world Ah, uh, veridicality is the key value. I couldn't understand the meaning, but what I could guess is that uh, what we are contributing is a small part to a much larger picture. Okay. So uh, unless we have the whole picture, we don't know the the importance that we are uh, the, the importance of our role in you know achieving that bigger target. So we are in, being given a training. in one particular dimension but how actually it is impacting on the overall scenario unless that is clear we will not value the kind of learning that we are going to get ha bhai anyone else also perfect very nice somebody else also who would like to throw some light on it uh if you allow sir divya again yeah divya so i believe you know the whole purpose of this point keeping it as a bigger uh, perspective is about uh, focusing on the aggregate cause of that particular session we are uh, holding yeah and uh, you know when when we are uh, uh, having a interactive session in you know uh, which is induced with the experimental learnings by you know exchanging the incidents the real real um, Uh, stories and examples uh, from the crowd within your own uh, database of learnings yeah. we have to make make it sure that it should relate with the real world so that you know basically it should be realistic and practical yeah it, it should be one should be able to correlate with it he he, he had covered it adequately maybe uh, 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 he was a little confused about the word they yes these all jargons don't get confused in life make keep things very simplified ye to because you see uh, these, these are part of the theoretical aspects otherwise simple terms mein it should be realistic a uh, individual who is receiving it should be able to correlate with the real world around him and it should be practical 
it can't be some uh, that is why the you see case studies are why they are important generally case studies are made on the real events why it is one of the otherwise case study jo hai cooked up case study will never succeed yeah if you have people i'm sure all of you must have gone through some case studies they are perpetually actually on based on real events which have converted into case studies for teachings sir i just want to add meena yeah meena so you were just saying na case study uh, we have just added a case study in our sessions because yeah. we are into service industry okay so we have just added a taj bomb blast that story how the staff has given the uh, support safety to the what who the uh, people are staying in the guests are staying in the hotel uh, so the services and the mouth publicity after that of the tata company is uh, raised uh, has uh, actually raised so how yeah. services is important yeah yeah so the case study actually we are just uh, sharing in our sessions because in uh, service industry is important it is important yes it is so this is a real story we are just sharing the real story uh, to the participant to the learner so that they can actually correlate the uh, service actually how uh, service is important in this industry yes it is yes it is good example incidentally i have been to that hotel post the uh, this thing for i had dinner there and uh, they conducted a surround in the hotel and uh, i do i was inquisitive because as a army officer my my brain was working differently what all where all uh, i'm i'm sorry to say i have no clue because the entire staff have entire staff they don't talk of the event if you want to know what had happened because what we all have seen it on television we have all seen a movie made on it which i have seen on netflix now a staff has been briefed so well and so motivated towards their hotel that they don't ever mention ki sorry sir we cannot talk of this we can't tell you where exactly what had happened they conducted us around took us anywhere and it they put it perfectly laid it out so that it it doesn't lead to some kind of a psycho fear in their guests in future and that's what just a case in point i thought i'll highlight that okay next point please thank you anyone else jiska mic chal raha ho jisne jaanboojh ke kharab kar rakha ho uske kuch nahi kar sakte hum ha sir arnab here ha arnab go swami to nahi ho tum nahi nahi no breaking news sir acha no breaking news ha main socha ear earbuds laga lu before hand Ah, sorry. Sorry, it was a lighter vein. Don't feel offended. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. A lot of my customers they end up asking the same question. I have to kind of make them comfortable. Uh, keep experiential. Make them feel safe. Chalo. <laughs> yeah. So last bit is create an emotional investment. Engage students to the point where they are doing strikes a personal central chord within the learner. Ah, uh, uh, sir, I think role play is also uh, kind of I could correlate with the entire six steps. So, for example, uh, they need to feel safe. Say, for example, uh, some people don't know how to say no. Ah, uh, while we train them on how to say no, it's a big leap of faith for them because they have been uh, used to saying yes to people. So, first thing is uh, making them feel safe. make them correlate with the concept um also keep the bigger pic- picture perspective which is business suffers if they don't say no at the right time which is non negotiable uh-huh. uh, build in reflection student should reflect on what they are learning and use that as an opportunity to incorporate in their life theory of life uh, so, now which which field are you in uh, s- sir i am uh, in learning and development for uh, around 16 years no Which 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 uh, uh, it's some company or you have? Uh... I am I am with NIIT. I am uh, handling strategic sales for uh, training. Okay, oh, okay. So you are a better teacher. You come this side of the laptop. <laughs> no, 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 sir, sir. Learning, learning. <laughs> I mean, every stage and age. Uh, I think uh, every every experience is a learning. This is experiential learning for me, sir. 
And my for good fortune, I can learn from someone who is from a force background. I tell you, you made my uh, day. Be a little loud. My wife has not heard it because she considers <laughs> he, she considers a liability living in the house. Uh, that part of the story is always there in the force, <laughs> sir. Perhaps. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Okay. Chalo. Good. Yeah. Good. Anyone else who want to wants to throw some light on these ladies? No. Keep. Yeah, look after them. Otherwise, they they will start cribbing. They will start admonishing us for no reason. Hello. Lady. Ah, yes, ma'am. Hello, sir. Sir Sunakshi here. Hi, Sunakshi. Hello. So I just wanted to add uh, for the emotional investment part that. Uh, so, like you are also been engaging us and uh, sharing your personal anecdotes with us. So yeah. I guess that when a trainer is uh, able to share a personal incident and uh, able to share with the participants that even he was once a participant and he is also in the learning phase, maybe uh, it's a better connectivity between the trainer and the participants that yes, we are he is similar to us, and you know we are it's nothing different. So maybe sharing a personal anecdote creates a connectivity between the participant and the. You trainer. see, as a trainer, the connectivity is the most important. Participative uh, training is always gives better input, better uh, sinking in into the people who are being taught. Otherwise, it is a monologue from one sided. Even if this is the best effort I can do because I am talking to a screen. You see, it, 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 the best is to have face to face interaction, which is always. More communicative, better. But uh, one is trying to thank you very much. I'm so uh, happy and no, pleased. No, sir. Uh, truly, it's actually very difficult as participants. It's difficult for us to share our view. But okay. as a teacher, you're trying to teach to a blank screen. That's like thousand times, I guess, more difficult for you. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much. Like it's very. That, that's very. That's very kind of you. You made my day. I'll have one extra drink this evening. Okay. <laughs> okay. Then let's go to the next one. Ha bhai. Abhi to kya 14 for 16 mein to only few have participated there are still um, uh, 16 people kitne ne participate kar liya 6 nahi kiya bhai. The points are just nine. So there are own up raise your hand. बड़ा मुश्किल है यार बेचारे चार लोग डोमिनेट कर रहे हैं बाकी बेचारे वॉचर्स हैं डूअर्स तो इतने ही रह गए हैं छह पांच छे हाँ भाई दिव्या हाँ चलो गुड आई एम सो हैप्पी सर सेवन पॉइंट इज मेक री एग्जामिन ऑफ वैल्यू पॉसिबल ओके so uh, here it is provide a learning culture that encourages the student to suspend their assumptions reflect on what they learn and allow themselves to rethink what okay. they know or value like okay. sir jaise abhi aapne bataya sir ki jaise hum koi cheez hai humne kisi points pe ba baat kiya hua hai theek hai some sometimes we have given a time to do the task but some at some of the point we lose the extent ki what we want to achieve so we have to reexamine and we have to conduct a again ki why we have not achieved this okay okay so this this kind of learning very nice very nice aap batao meena kahan gayi somebody else also to add to it yes sir ha bhai meena batao serial 7 sir uh, once the uh, learning done then after that learning continuous process has to be there so uh, that allows the uh, participant to rethink on if if they go with the relearn process again through quizzes and all okay okay chalo now come to the eighth one now since you have already come on the mic otherwise okay. i'll be talking okay okay sir okay. modern meaningful relationship um, by treating student as valued owners and partners in the learning process the teacher models the importance of integrated relationship and knowledge so uh, we we are not matlab we as a trainer needs to be uh, not only imparting the knowledge only we actually create a relationship with the students learners also and you see i'll okay i'll just say ki you we are teaching adults when you go and do in corporate world also 
you ought to be very respectful to the people who are there and the who are at the moment you give a negative stroke thereafter a person goes into a shell and does not open up does not his faculties start working to defend himself to protect himself i'll give you a very simple example a very very it has got nothing to do with a a child in a in a in a classroom a one ch- um, uh, i'm sure you all must have experienced this in a classroom there are 30 children sitting and one child asks a question and suppose there is a math class going on or koi doubt usko ho gaya division mein or multiplication plus minus mein on the board a teacher is saying very usne kahi pooch liya haath raise karke ma'am ye kya hota if the teacher says are tumhe itna bhi nahi aata it's a very simple dialogue are tumhe itna bhi nahi aata bait jao and then she explains it but mere fact that she said are tumhe itna bhi nahi aata actually she is given a negative stroke to that child and put that child permanently back into the shell wherein that child will not open up will not ask questions and will feel scared ki meri bezati ho jayegi क्लास में और बच्चों को पता चल रहा है कि मुझे नहीं आता है यू सी इट्स अ वेरी बेसिक नेगेटिव स्ट्रोक बट इट कैन कॉज अ परमानेंट डैमेज टू द साइकी ऑफ अ चाइल्ड एम आई करेक्ट मी इफ आई एम रॉन्ग दिस इज माय ऑब्जर्वेशन करेक्ट सर एब्सोल्युटली एब्सोल्युटली करेक्ट सर एब्सोल्युटली बिकॉज़ यू सी बहुत छोटा बच्चा है उसका कोई एक छोटा एग्जाम सिंपल सा सम उसको अगर समझ में नहीं आ रहा है तो इवन इफ ही आस don't discourage him don't give a negative stroke otherwise he'll never ask questions his inquisitiveness will be curbed and right at the word go it will never learn he'll never improve things and i'm sorry ladies and gentlemen you are fathers and mothers uh, please ensure that you follow that uh, uh, with your own children um, this is what i feel that because it's a very small negative stroke it can cause lot of psychological damage chalo Uh, um, this was Divya or Meena? Who was that? I'm sorry. Sir, oh, Meena. Meena, good, good point. Very well covered. Okay, let's go to the uh, last point, ladies and gentlemen. So let me read last point also then. Okay, you, I, you have made my day. At least I have been able to motivate one out of sixteen. So we, uh, I am taking session for, I uh, mean, our company induction session, virtual session, for twenty four days. Oh. Okay. with almost 40 learners so uh, connecting everyone and when when are we we as a trainer not getting any response from the participants now we also feel very bad uh, <laughs> so i understood <laughs> very well and uh, i am going through on it you are in my <laughs> booth so you understand ha tabhi to hum kehte hain sabka mic on karate hain चलो एक्सप्लोरिंग कंफर्ट जोन अलाउंग लर्निंग टू चैलेंज प्री कंसीव थिंकिंग में चैलेंज स्टूडेंट कंफर्ट जोन ट्रांसफॉर्मेटिव लर्निंग इज एन एसेंशियल एलिमेंट ऑफ द लर्निंग प्रोसेस सो गिव देम द कंफर्ट जोन टू आस्क एंड एक्सप्लोर या ओके माय अंडरस्टैंडिंग इज कि टू गिव देम द कंफर्टेबल जोन एंड आस्क डोंट डोंट डिस्कस Uh, it is uh, they are quite uh, they are basically quite akin to each other most of the points basically i was trying to highlight what is important in terms of uh, training you all are budding trainers so this is exactly what uh, you should find now this ideal is difficult to achieve ladies and gentlemen can anyone become highly skilled in all these abilities हमने भाई ये पूरा इसलिए लिख रखा है बिकॉज हम कम्युनिकेट नहीं कर सकते डायरेक्टली तो इट इज बेटर दैट यू आर एबल टू रीड ऑल्सो कैन एनी वन कैन एनी वन बिकम हाईली स्किल्ड इन ऑल दीज एस्पेक्ट और आर दे नेसेसरली इन कॉन्फ्लिक्ट विथ इच अदर हाउ कैन वन हाउ कैन वन बी कॉन्क्रीट एंड इमीजिएट एंड स्टिल बी थेरेटिकल डू यू अंडरस्टैंड दिस two main dimensions to learning process how we perceive new information or experience and how we process process what we perceive i, I, I is it possible to elaborate on this 
two main di- dimensions correspond to two major different ways to which we learn we perceive things and then we process them how we perceive new information and or experience and how we process what we perceive elaborate on this somebody sir uh, i feel yes, how first one is how yeah yeah Go ahead. continue continue sir rupesh yeah. go ahead huh? okay shall i okay yeah uh, arnab here uh, okay sir my view of of this is uh, how we perceive new information will be different for different person because perception is uh, is is based on our mental model also you you are right perception is based on cognitive thinking and behavior basically the environment in which you are it it will differ from every individual every individual even the background will make a difference even the your household where you belong to your family background all will make a difference in your your personality date traits what you call it okay go ahead rupesh you were saying something you can continue yeah yeah uh, perception means matlab what i understand personal uh, personal uh, uh, sorry perception means personal reception actually okay so differ uh, personal to personal so what we perceive from uh, society from i mean from anyone so uh, i mean uh, it is it is our uh, mental status how we process in our uh, own uh, way of style or something like that okay okay yeah to add to that sir yeah 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 to add to that i think we all have our own way of looking at things uh, hearing out things same things two people can hear but uh, interpret two different meanings and and Mean, meaning out of you are absolutely right uh, um, i'll give you example of uh, this thing two things i'll give two example one is i was in united nations and i am talking of 1993 94 now maybe ha huh, those days only i had gone now when i landed up india was still in the pro- economy was developing and we were in a very bad shape in fact gold had to be mortgaged to england in 1990 i don't know you people may not remember that now when i went there found a cultural i came from in and I, let me tell you army is reasonably modern society compared to rest of the uh, environment in, in the in the country army has got a very uh, liberal and modern uh, society in terms of adaptability because it's it had it had basically army is a legacy of the britishers it was uh, it was never uh, the indian it was a british army which converted so basically the ethos and culture and it remained very westernized now it has got indianized to a great level now i must tell you in spite of that when i went abroad first time i found the culture of the united nations very different which i was not used to in the office i found people sitting um uh, even the ladies also and uh, officer the men also they all are drinking can of beer and smoking and working on the laptops it was a cultural shock for me because those days in india it was not possible not happening now it is quite rampant in the and various places but those days it was not there so it was basically what affected me was the environment from which i had come and i had come in a totally dude and i had cognitive uh, analysis i was doing because basically i already had a certain preconceived ideas based on the environment in which i had lived all all my life and there jaake i was processing and then making a framework there was a time you will con- consider a lady having a drink or a glass of wine a taboo oh, 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 bahut ye to she is a loose character woman or she smokes a very bad woman these days uh, possibly it may not be of course smoking generally has gone down in fact it has gone down drastically in the men improved a lot in the women and uh, uh, but drinking and all it used to be a big taboo not anymore things have changed quite a lot because the environment has changed the perceptions have changed lot of pubs which have come up they were not heard of earlier in india 
now they all are all over you find pubs you go to bangalore you go to noida also anywhere in delhi so the entire society has changed and acceptability has gone up and that why that is why it has changed and these are the two example uh, uh, second example i've forgotten which i wanted to give sorry i i'll not now because the mark se utar gaye it should not be possible okay uh, anything else on this chalo very good can you hear me are you hearing me yes sir yes sir okay, okay. Yes, i thought sir. it it played in my mind ki this is what my experience was based on my uh, background okay how we perceive the new information the concrete abstract dimension se to chodo bekar hai ye is pe aao what is concrete experience this first one which we are talking of in that cycle the tangible felt qualities of the world as they favored means of perceiving grasping and taking hold of new information now what example i was giving you is based on this if you correlate somebody lands up in a in a new place and where culturally it is so different then he'll go through a cultural shock it was something like that that is the concrete experience with when if anyone can give us some other example it will be so nice any other example sir like dreams were not there if we see uh, some some years back yeah so now people uh, don't uh, matlab was not where matlab was not taking care of their health and they are not uh, doing the exercises and all ha ah. so green tea and uh, due to green tea and james is very famous now for ah. the, uh, health so yes. now people are taking care of health and uh, taking green tea and going gym daily ha ah. so it was not there ha ah, people have become very health conscious they go for run they go to gym they go for morning walks and things like which has become a culture which was uh, uh, not there earlier yes very nice anything else anyone else hello beech beech mein hello bolna padta hai yes. ha hello do you know why it hello came dr gram bells daughter's <laughs> name was hello are you aware yes sir yes yeah i know sir chalo okay हाँ भाई बोलो यार तुम लोग बोलते नहीं अभी मैं यहाँ से बॉक्सिंग करने वाला हूँ सो दिस इज अवर न्यू टेक्नोलॉजी व्हाट वी आर डूइंग करेंटली हाँ इसमें तो स्कूल टीचर की तरह एक सन्टी भी नहीं दिखा सकते हैं मीना बेस्ट एग्जांपल बेस्ट एग्जांपल इज सर लाइक कोई स्माइली फेस ही दे सकते हैं सर हाँ सॉरी Yeah, yeah. Best best example is uh, like Zoom meeting, sir. I mean, the students are taking class on Zoom, and uh, so many meetings are going on Zoom. So uh, I mean, uh, it's yeah, this is a new. This is a new. We have accepted. This is a new experience for the. I am struggling. I am experiencing. Yeah, to, it is every time. It is a quite a bloody exercise for me. Next time, I'm going to get. I don't know. And then, what will happen? Some people admitted, not admitted. This will happen. Okay. Hello. Yeah. So so many things. Now, if you if you see, sir, uh, automated car. Now, e scooter is coming. So there yeah. are new technologies coming. We are uh, use using this and implementing this. And okay. we are just referring to our uh, friends also. So we are using new technologies. Ah, you know, so you are car. Chala le. Ah, again, again, example is say. It ki sabse achhi dete hain concrete experiences when ah. Uh, somebody comes from the village to delhi to pick up a job he doesn't get a job he first learns wants to learn driving because he wants to drive a ola or or whatever uber taxi he is made to sit in a vehicle he sits in a vehicle he watches the driver ki ye isne clutch dabaya abhi brake kiya abhi accelerator dabaya abhi is dande ko ghuma raha hai gear badal raha so that is what he is watching Mm-hmm. and he is analyzing it after that he gets into his senses are working 
immerse themselves in concrete reality and rely heavily on the intuition ke how it works and sit back and think through elements of the situation analytically basically he analyzes it ki how the car is driven dad ye jo gol pahiya ya haath mein pakde isse the wheel is kept straight clutch se badal ke he changes the gear right wala lever hai usko dabao to accelerate hoti hai he is making a you you put yourself somebody us to we are experienced so we all drive so obviously you will not be able to connect it well you think of a villager who has come and becomes a taxi driver and thereafter he is analyzing it that's the what part is this concrete experience ke baad intuition reflective 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 what अरे बोलो यार रिफ्लेक्टिव ऑब्जर्वेशन ही इज मेकिंग बाय वॉचिंग एवरीथिंग देन ही बाय आफ्टर दैट ही कॉन्सेप्चुलाइज दैट इज ही बेसिकली मेक्स अ इमेज कि दिस इज हाउ थिंग्स विल बी डन हैव यू अंडरस्टूड ही कॉन्सेप्चुलाइज कि दिस इज हाउ द वहीकल विल बी ड्रिवन and thereafter he is put on a wheel active ah that is us me what your active experimentation yes sir. whereas there is a co driver sitting who's got control and and when he starts driving then he realizes that if we are yaar ye to sensitive zyada hai clutch zyada sensitive hai brake isko zyada daba de to bahut tez bhagti hai usko humko kam damana padega so basically he is uh, experimenting. experimenting with it by those experiments he again it, it he goes into some makes the corrective experiment and lands up in the concrete experience cycle again mm. and then again it does a analysis and when his skills improve then he starts accelerating then he starts analyzing at the, what time should i what speed should i change the gear and gradually his skills improve and then he is after 15 days 20 days of training in a training school then he is put on the road on his own to drive a taxi uh, so this is what i feel is the total raw say one can give a example on this okay it is a continu continuum continuum process basically continuous process it's a cycle okay both modes of acha this is one more thing i want to tell you now this is please correlate with that goal cycle which we had talked of now it is criss cross both modes of concrete and abstract are equally valuable both are their strength have their strengths and weaknesses now concrete experience and abstract conceptualization both have got equal uh, value because basically they are more or less the same how we process what we perceive the active reflective dimension now they are the have you understood what i am talking of this is up and down if you see that cycle concrete experience is on the top and abstract conceptualization as is on the bottom have you made the cycle on somewhere pen pencil say or something at nearby yes sir. yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, and then you they are correlated basically they are conceptually they are the same things which we have except that the skill levels are uh, changed and then also connected to this is on the left side you have active experimentation and right side is reflective observation observation okay. have you understood now there are two types of people one is what i was telling you who jump into the gun directly yes yeah, they jump the active reflective dimension may the process or in processing a new experience some of us given a choice would jump right into it and try our hand jo hum bata rahe the car maine jo chalana mujhe kisi ne nahi sikhaya i learned by hit and trial i बिकॉज कौन सिखाता उस उम्र में यार तो आई नेवर वेंट टू माई वाइफ लर्न ड्राइविंग बाय गोइंग टू अ ड्राइविंग स्कूल एंड आई लर्न बाय वच यू एक्सपेरिमेंटिंग माई सेल्फ सो दीज आर दैट्स वाई विद ड्यू रिस्पेक्ट इन रिगार्ड्स टू ऑल द लेडीज 
these are the skills these are the uh, particular traits more you will find in men because they had those liberties in earlier now all boys and girls everyone has the same liberties whereas women you are they are watchers they watch and reflect basically reflective observation now they'll make a, a girl and a boy in a same family brother and sister the sister will first see the boy doing some adventurism then only sister sister sees that the nahi mere bhai ko kuch nahi hua then she also starts doing it whether it comes to going to swimming pool whether it is going to playing bloody cricket in the garden initially she would not like to bloody take the risk of bloody ball coming straight on her face when she has to do batting but when she finds are hamare bhai ne maar diya to hame bhi maar sakte hum bhi kar sakte hain when it comes to various other skills um uh, but these days uh, i've seen girls are doing better jobs they, that's why they in the in the in the in the what do you call exams and all relatively percentage wise women do much better than the men even the best of firing teams shooting teams of um, uh, of the country have got very very skilled women who fire, shoot very well compared to very many boys <laughs> okay so earlier in terms may more men used to be in ex- active experimentation and more women used to be in reflective observation that is watchers doers are basically active experimentation type of people and watchers are basically reflective Defective. observation type of people kya time hua yaar both are parallel both are equally important both have their own value their own traits they have own uh, strengths and weaknesses so don't feel that anyone is superior or anyone is inferior nothing of this nature so but beech beech mein i have to keep the women in good humor otherwise naraz ho jayenge ha bhai hai divya naraz to nahi ho भाई पढ़ो तुम स्लाइड पढ़ो दिव्या स्लेप्ट ऑफ शी स्लेप्ट ऑन पोस्ट लंच ना तो शी स्लेप्ट ऑफ मीना सर नाउ टाइम टाइम हो गया बहुत हो गया गुड रिटर्न्स टू बैड रबिश हो गया एनीवे चलो क्या टाइम टाइम क्या हुआ है 5:30 हो गया है ओके अरे आई डिडंट रियलाइज इट तभी सबने जानबूझ के बोलना बंद कर दिया हमने नहीं नहीं सर तो हम मौन, पिछली बार तो काफी मोनोलॉग था वैसे भी मेरी स्लाइड बंद हो गई है यार आगे की चल नहीं रही है अरे यार ये क्या agli baar i'll have to improve things i'll come 15 minutes earlier and try to run it sir ek bar reverse karke fir aage forward kar lijiye ho jaye ha ha ek bar reverse kar lijiye wo piche hi nahi ja rahi hai yaar na aage ja rahi sir it is a it is a bounce back method actually isko bhi lagta hai time da ye ha sir ha sir alt f4 kar lijiye sab khatam ho jayega ha <laughs> anyway, anyway, there is there are certain things in our head. There is a there is a certain thing which I wanted to give a link of the presentation. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Uh, uh, if you all send your email, send one email, and or you put all in one place and send it to me. To it will be so nice. So, एक ही बार में हम दोनों presentation उसमें attach करके गो कर देंगे सबके पास चला जाएगा वर्मा सर के पास सब कुछ है सुबह से वो वो ले चुके हैं वर्मा सर के पास है तो सही हमारा मेल आईडी अच्छा ठीक है देन देन आई विल सेंड इट टू वर्मा आई विल सेंड बोथ द लास्ट टाइम प्रेजेंटेशन बिकॉज़ ही वाज आस्किंग फॉर मी एंड दिस वन आई विल सेंड टू हिम एंड ही विल सेंड इट इन दैट बेसिकली अ थिंग व्हिच आई वन हैज नॉट बीन एबल टू रीच बिकॉज़ ऑफ स्लाइड नॉट ऑपरेटिंग देयर इज अ पर्टिकुलर प्रेजेंटेशन व्हिच आई हैव basically it's a not my presentation i found it it on the internet i thought it is worth the various theories mm. of content and processing and things like which you must 
uh, go through because they do ask short uh, notes on this and some some of the uh, enlarged questions are also asked on one of the theories maslow's theory and various other theories so, so it is always good to go through them so that you are able to uh, write about them and it, it's a very well made presentation by somebody that's on the internet so i've i've put a link there that i'll give it to you so that you can see it that's all from my side ladies and gentlemen next class is on when 5th or 8th when eighth. is it 8th so next monday that's varma yes sir oh what a delight varma tum bahut time se meri last slide phas gayi hai isme aage chal hi nahi rahi hai sir aap right click karo अरे हो गया यार हम कर चुके हैं नहीं जा रहा एनीवे वर्मा आई एल सेंड यू यू सेंड इट मैं आपको आपको भेज दूंगा बहुत ही प्रेजेंटेशंस यू कैन फॉरवर्ड टू पीपल राइट थैंक यू लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन इट हैज बीन सच अ आई आई ओनली वांट टू से आई लाइक पार्टिसिपेटिव वे ऑफ टॉकिंग ऑफ क्लासेस इट विल बी सो नाइस इफ मोस्ट ऑफ यू Uh, speak so that we i know something is going on otherwise it becomes very difficult all the very best do well god bless thank you sir thank, thank you thank you thank so you. nice of you thank you good evening thank Bye. you guys and see you all good evening sir thank you november okay thank thank you varma sir and waiting for the just presentation 4th of october and today is only okay okay thank, thank you bye bye thank you sir thank you very much thank you sir bye sir bye sir वर्मा सर आप ट्रांसफर कर दीजिए हाँ हाँ हम कर देंगे अभी ईमेल पे अटैच करके भेजते हैं यार अब अब होस्ट जूम का होस्ट ट्रांसफर कर दीजिए हाँ हाँ अब अब नाउ यू कैन सी दी स्लाइड ना इज इट नहीं स्लाइड तो गया चला गया ये कंटेंट थेरीज एंड प्रोसेस थेरीज पे था ना जो आई कुंट कवर दैट बिकॉज टाइम की वजह से आई 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 सेंड इट टू they will they will do it humne bata diya link bhi de diya oh, okay zavarma thank you god bless host transfer kar diye sir mera naam press kar to ye ye kahan se karte hain ruko mera naam pe press karenge na more oh ho oh, oh. abhi are there are some people there is sandeep is sudeep is still there kahan se hota hai yaar ah varma ye participant feedback ka wahi link fill kar do na main yeah yeah I have sent on WhatsApp also and uh, here on chat also. So okay, finally, uh, go to that form and fill it up today itself by any time. Yeah. So that by uh, tomorrow we can prepare the. Varma, how do I transfer it to you? Sir, if you press on my name, na more comes and then uh, it shows post. Participants me. Participants me. मेरे नाम पे प्रेस करेंगे तो हम तो पिछली बार हमें हमें एक्चुअली इतने दिन हो गए ना भूल गए पिछली बार का तो याद है मोर था व्यू 